What's up guys? I often get asked, Armando, what are the benefits of rooting and should I root my Android device? Since Android is so powerful out of the box, a lot of people believe that there is no benefit to rooting your Android phone. You see, when people jailbreak their iPhone, a lot of the times, 99% of the time, is to get features that Android already has without the need of root. But you'd be surprised what you can do when you have root access. So I'm gonna show you some good examples and maybe we'll convince you to root your phone. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first app I wanna talk about is Titanium Backup. This should be no stranger to those that already have rooted their device. I'd almost say this app alone is worth rooting your phone. This app allows you to not only back up your apps, but also system files and data. So say if you decided to buy a new tablet or change your phone, Titanium Backup lets you easily restore all of your data. Currently, when you buy a new device, Google will download all of the apps that you had before, but it doesn't save any data. So if you were on level 30 on Angry Birds, you would have to start all over. Titanium Backup also has other built-in features like the ability to remove system files. So if your phone came with bloatware, you can easily remove those pesky apps. You can also freeze an app, which basically means the app still lives inside the device, but Android won't run it. You can also create a flashable update zip, which basically means all of your apps and data will be stored in a zip file. You can later use that zip file on a different device, and all you need to do is just flash that zip file and everything will be restored. Titanium Backup is full of features that can be a video on its own, and although other apps like Carbon exist that don't need root access, it's not nearly as flexible nor customizable like Titanium Backup. Rooting can unlock other features and this next app will give you the ability to tether. With tether, you can share your internet connection from your phone to other Wi-Fi capable devices. This can be very useful when traveling and your device is only Wi-Fi capable. I often use it to give my Nexus 10 internet while I'm on the road. Another great app to consider when you are rooted is AdFree. This will block all ads from apps that display ads and even websites. Here's an example of an app that normally has an ad, but with AdFree you will see that there are no ads and you'll never see one again. Although I can sit here and go through so many great apps that will enhance your phone, the biggest benefit of rooting is the ability to change out the ROM. So if you have a phone that has not received the latest Android update, or if you're like me and want to try something different, there are a lot of great developers out there that create ROMs that will take Android to a whole different level. Take for example the current ROM I am running called Paranoid. They have a feature that I like called Expanded Desktop which hides the bottom soft keys. This feature allows me to see more and use up the whole screen real estate, but the best part of it is that I can still use my phone by using gestures to enable what is called the Pi menu. Here I get all of my soft keys back temporarily while maintaining my expanded desktop mode. I even installed it on my Nexus 10 so that when my daughter is playing a game, she can't exit out of the app and has really worked like a charm until she can figure out how to enable it. Features like these can't be found on even stock Android, which is why rooting your device will allow you to flash the ROM of your choice. But even if you didn't want to take the plunge in changing out the ROM, there are other apps and tools that can give your phone a performance boost. Take for example Franco Kernel. This app replaces the existing kernel on your device. But aside from that, it also gives you control to fine tune your device. Some features include allowing you to undervolt or overclock your CPU the ability to change the frequencies of the CPU. You can also completely shut down one of the cores, which can save battery life drastically, and there's a ton of other features included in that app. And although some of these may sound scary to you, Franco has built-in presets, or you can check out the forums to read what settings people have that offer the best performance while still having optimal battery life. But even applications that don't require root access from the Play Store have extended features within the app. Take for example Widget Locker, an app that allows you to create a custom lock screen. Although no root is required to use this app, it does however have added features which will make the app better to use if your device is rooted. The same goes for Tasker, an app that I use religiously and many other great apps that will give you extended features. So you see, rooting gives you the ultimate control on your Android device, and it is something that you shouldn't be afraid to do. 
Rooting your device can be a very painless process and in some cases as easy as one click. If you're ready to take the plunge, I highly recommend you check out the XDA developer forums and search for your device and if anything else, there's a lot of people there to help. So don't be shy or afraid. Now, if you guys enjoyed this video, please share this with all your friends. If you liked the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and recommend it to all your friends and family. I can't stress enough how important Root is. I'll give you a quick little story. The other day I went to my dad's house. I took my laptop there that had never been connected to his Wi-Fi network. He wasn't there to give me the password, but I had my phone that had been connected to his Wi-Fi network before. So what did I do? I downloaded an app that was able to get the password from his Wi-Fi network because I had already connected to his network before and I was able to use the password to connect with my laptop. So little things like that is when you really appreciate having root access. Anyhow guys, I hope once again you enjoyed the video. Please share this with all your friends and I will see you in my next video. Adios.